Hello everybody and welcome to Team Fantastic Match Day 3 of uh, Season 12, Rebel. Um, ah, the total record doesn't do anything, but there you go. We've got two Claw Pom Warriors, two Claw Mighty Warriors, a Claw Mighty Tackle Beastman, five tacklers total, two dirty players, 13 men. It's obviously a fantastic, amazing team. The best team in Rebel, probably. Um, Jimene Eric has got, you know, they're a lizard man team, but nothing special. But he, he's going to have a wizard and a skink and, you know, he's going to have uh, 520 <laughs> inducements. So, silly billy wizard and an apple or something. Bribe. Oh, I miscalculated how much how much there was. I, I he could actually have uh, he could have the stubby man. I didn't realise he could have had the stubby man. That's literally why I sucked a guy. Silly Billy Apple. Oh no no I, no no no! I didn't. He hadn't. Got, he hasn't got a wizard. He hasn't got a wizard. Oh, brilliant! He just got an apple and a babe instead of a wizard. Well, maybe he hasn't. He's thinking about it. He's gone to bribe instead of an apple. What a mad ass. Bribe and a bib instead of a wizard. I mean, that's great for me, isn't it? Winning the game. That's fantastic for winning the game. A bribe is not going to do a lot for him. Um, a babe is, might not do much. An apple might not do much. Slibbly's obviously really good, but he can't apple there. Um, I'm I'm shocked. I'm honestly shocked he didn't get a wizard. That's incredible. This is probably going to be the only game this season where I don't face a wizard. <laughs> and yeah, well, that's incredible. I'm very happy about not having to face a wizard. Means I can receive on the toss. Of course, don't win the toss. Ah, it's spelt wrongly. Right, throw rocks cancel my stadium. Uh, defense. Oh, what happened with my YouTube channel is um, it's been deleted um, <laughs> by by YouTube. Um, I have appealed to get it undeleted. So hopefully it will be it will be back. But yeah, for now, um, they decreed that it broke some fucking rules, um, which I don't see how it did. So I, I think it'll be back. I think it should be back. But um, unfortunately, um, you know, I've got to wait on it. All right, so we've got a wrestler on the LOS. I think wrestler's all right on the LOS, isn't he? Save the ball carrier for second half. Uh, this guy, most protected, I guess. I've got to expose the warriors, haven't I? Because I can't, they're, they're less valuable than strength up beast men. Um, right. I like how all five, the rule of five guys have all got tackle. That's incredible, isn't it? That's very handy against uh, skinks, but against everybody, like elves and shit. Against other bash teams that might have some dodge spammed. Having a bunch of tackle. I'm probably gonna have more more tackle uh, more tackle bloat than claw bloat in a lot of games. <laughs> five claws and five tackle. That's pretty good. I should really make it a YouTube command, shouldn't I? Spread Goldock throwing a plinth. That's amazing. That's amazing. I'll certainly try to kill the the super skink. Yeah. I mean, I'm never not going to try to kill. I'm going to kill all of his players, don't I? Oh, the lizard blizzard! And we're in a blizzard. <laughs> He's caught the ball. Okay. 
I think he's going to hand off to him. I, w- I was hoping that he'd be tempted to carry it and try and skill up a Saurus, because then obviously he takes a Saurus out of the fight, which is rather good. For me, not for him. <laughs> Call Mr. Throw, that's his name. That name again is Mr. Throw. I'm actually getting a base. Uh, Fucking lizard men on defense. Oh, boy, that's fucking nuts, isn't it? This team. This team is so fucking good. It's ridiculous. <laughs> He's trying to protect against the frenzy, isn't he? But I mean, I've got the other guy anyway. Don't have to blitz with the, the frenzy guy. He's also over here anyway, the frenzy guy. Um, I mean, I could blitz the uh, crocs. Doesn't seem really worth it, does it? I can just blitz that closest guy. Get everyone up next turn. Protecting the guard, I think. He's not plus movement anymore, is he? So he's literally, the, in fact, he's worse than this guy now. <laughs> so it begins. Yeah, I'm not a fan of break tackle like that. No, absolutely not. Yeah, the gym powers have begun, haven't they? Uh, he's made five out of five knockdowns. But to be fair, one was uh, one was three dice. Uh, he hasn't made any removals. So. I'm thinking you'll score quickly because if you don't score quickly against this team you're likely to not score at all He did the old uh, select on somebody afterwards and didn't get punished. Now, you can argue that he shouldn't be punished for cyanide shitty UI, but it would have still been nice, wouldn't it? <laughs> if I blitz him, I'm not frenzy trapped. Um... But he is his worst player. If I blitz him, it's just awful. If I blitz him, it's a frenzy trap. But only an all one D, which isn't bad. Um, so you could argue that's worth it, couldn't you? Sorry. 
These guys are a bit tied up now. I know he's got a break tackle, but still, he's still a bit tied up, isn't he? Hmm. Annoying movement for. I could stick him on him. No, 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 he can punch him and then he can hit him. I should have put him there. Oh, well, oops. Oops. Doesn't matter. That was a bit of a fuck up that. My right, cheeky frenzy trap. Hey, doesn't matter. Over committing. Who's over committing? I'm not over committing at all, am I? Six here, five there, that's quite balanced. Parallel to where he is. Powder. He's not over committing because he's just made a bit of a He's just made a bit of a push, hasn't he? This was a real bad one. I, he should have been up here. Because at the moment he's got a hit, hit there into a 2D and he should have been there. So that he, he, I really fucked up there. That was a really bad spot. Should have been one higher. At least it encourages him to just make dumb blocks with them rather than reposition the break tackle, I guess. Like it was a fucking Tuesday. <sighs> no, well, he hasn't done that anyway, so uh, he's just trying to free up men. So uh, it worked out all right that that move up there because I would have I didn't want to go too far back, which is why I didn't want to mark him in the better spot. But uh, it's worked out because he didn't even hit him anyway. Glorious. It could, couldn't it? He needs to power things. I mean, he, he'd rolled a lot of powers before, but now it's now he's based up. It's a bit tricky, isn't it? Of course, I could just punch him back and get nothing. <laughs> I could hit him back and get absolutely fuck all. Got the least relevant power there, which is rather nice. Interesting. Where will the ball go? <laughs> A plim plom plu. Uh, the ball will not go anywhere. Oh, mon chéri. 
I blim blom blue. <laughs> I can push him into a claw hit. That seems good. Oh, no, I can't. Right, the blitz is going to come over here then. Can claw silly Billy. <laughs> that seems okay. Moline. <laughs> yeah, it was, wasn't it? It was, it was a facey laugh, that's why I said Marlene. There you go. See, great minds think alike. <laughs> uh, yep, this is alright. It's a bit of a frenzy. Once again, it's a bit of a frenzy trap, but, you know, we don't really care about frenzy traps here. See? What does he do here? <laughs> like, what the actual fuck <laughs> does he do? Uh, he's trapped. He's there. He can blitz or something. He can dodge and then go this way. That seems the obvious thing to try and get away out that way. Um, I could try and blitz in here, chain him, block him, try and get down this side. But I think whatever happens is better. I could just go over the middle here. The bad thing is the fucking blizzard means he can go on the sideline and I'm going to have to GFI. At least this way, if he made it the other sideline, I can just GFI once. Yeah, potatoes looking like his only option, isn't it? Or run back. Run back or potato are <laughs> literally the only options at this point for him. <laughs> I mean, this team is brutal, you know. People who say this team isn't the best team in Rebel just must not understand Blood Bowl. Honestly, because it's it's disgusting. Like, what do you even do against this team? I would hate to have to play this team. Like, with anybody coaching it. Because they just herp derp you and you're like... Yeah, he's pretty, he's pretty decent. I played him before, he was pretty good. <laughs> no, no, it's just... It's subs only, isn't it? Another one in another nine in days, it's really you. Fifty percent. <laughs> yes, Thomas D, you did. You did somewhat dice living fuck out of me though, didn't you? <laughs> perm two perm the chaos warrior under strength four beastman. Can't uh can't <laughs> realistically expect to outbash this team with dark elves on a on a regular on a regular basis. <laughs> I mean, it's going to happen sometimes, obviously. Dice, isn't it? it? Is a dice game. Where we go? There's a fail. Yeah, of course you can't say anything about that. No. Yeah, no, I played before. He was, he, he played well. 
Yes, it is. It is <laughs> always pretty meaningless. Oh, you can get... You see, he did the sidestep to score this turn, so maybe I should have stayed on the side. That was pretty good, wasn't it? Should have, Maybe I should have stayed there. But if I'd stayed there, he would have just chained him to here and then gone 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, GFI, GFI, right? So, I had to go in the middle, really. Well, it's not that it's only CCL, it's just that it's always meaningless, isn't it? It wouldn't matter if it's CCL or Rebel or anything. It's all pretty meaningless. That was nice, wasn't it? Give up the block to keep them occupied, get killed. <laughs> Poor old fucking cold cuts there. Equal attrition, but he's only got one reserve and I've got two. Yeah, that's true. That's true. That's true. If someone's got a bad... If someone's got a bad, played a few games and has a bad rating, then um, like, then they're bad, aren't they? But he hasn't played many games at all, has he? So, if he played ten times that number and had fifty percent, then you could draw some vague conclusion. You can draw vague conclusions from CCL, but it's obviously it's not super relevant ever. Right. Right, this is there's punching to be had here, isn't there? Alright, this is a nice one. In here. I like how I could have pushed the crocs away from my killer um, and didn't. That was a smart move. Away instead of pushing into there. That was also great. I don't know why I did that. I mean, if I pushed him to there, then I could have blitzed this guy, couldn't I? Hmm. Quite like the ball. Right, now the question is do I uphill? Do I uphill blitz the Crocs? I think we all know the answer to that. You only live twice. Fuck. <laughs> well, but I mean, if someone, you know, if someone's got a, I don't know, if someone's got a 50, if someone's played 100 games in CCL and they've got a 50% win rate, then unless they learn to play there, you prob they're probably not top tier, are they? I mean, that's just a, you know, you can just kind of make, like, it's not a sweeping generalisation, is it? You can just draw the odd, you know, and something, you can get something, you can get some kind of limited information out of it, can't you? It's not saying that, no, it's not, it's not saying that, I'm not saying they're bad, I'm just saying you can probably put, like, you know, you can determine the range, can't you? Like, 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 like in Pogo, you can put people on a range, right? You can kind of you can kind of do that a little bit, a little bit. You can see what races they use and everything. Of course they do, yeah. Of course, Norielensis. But they're still probably better than most people, right? Wow. GBO. Well, his bribe's gone at least. Yeah, I'm, I'm not saying it's perfect, you know, don't get me wrong, I'm not saying it's perfect. I'm just, you know, you'd obviously be idiotic to draw any conclusions from it or anything, but um, it's some information, isn't it? And it's just, it's just something. I mean, it's all opinions at the end of the day, isn't it, Villa Hobbier? 
And look, at the end of the day, if you get if you got some good players, <laughs> um, yeah, it's part of the picture exactly. At the end of the day, you know, you know, you know who people are like. In your subjective opinion, <laughs> you know who's good, don't you? You know, you you know the fucking you know uh, K feels good, and you know that uh, other people are good. And, uh, I shouldn't have blocked with this guy, shouldn't I? He's got wrestle. He should have blocked. Then he would, I could have blocked him into a claw hit. That was a bit dumb. Now, this is a potential GFI here. Um, so let's secure the ball first. I am a sub 70% shipper, shipper, that's true. I don't think people who are sub 70% are shitters though. <laughs> In my defense. In my defense, I don't believe everyone below 70 is a shitter. But if someone's the over 70, there's chances are they're not going to be shit, isn't it? You know? <laughs> like, that's about as much as you can say. <laughs> That's about as much as you can say. If someone's got a 70% win rate, they're probably not shit. I probably shouldn't have fouled here, should I? Um, but I just wanted to foul him back because he fouled me. That was, I mean, that was really stupid. Now I've got 11 men max. That was really dumb. I just literally, because he fouled me, I wanted to foul him. Hello, oh, good day, Nick. Not great. I was really played really badly then. <laughs> I played really badly. Of course, I'll roll a double one, you know? The fact that he's removed my claw pommer makes me think, oh, I can foul him. No, I can't foul him back. Hello, oh, I can't start. <laughs> of course, I can't fucking foul him back. I could have let him done the foul, and then he would have rolled a double one, and he would have been sent off, and then everything would have been right with the wall. But instead. <laughs> yeah, exactly, yeah, careful, exactly, yeah, and like, you know, they build good teams or whatever. At the end of the day, it does show you whether they're likely to win or not. Now, whether you, how you think that happens is, is another thing, isn't it? But it definitely shows you who's likely to win, you know? That's, that, like, that was the thing that everyone said about uh, Fumble, when, uh, you know, everyone calls that guy shit. Um, can't remember his name. Uh, who's that guy? Everyone calls shit. Um, anyway, there's a guy. Small man. Um, and he's shit, <laughs> you know, I think he's shit as well, everyone thinks he's shit, but he has like a really great win rate, win rate because he min maxes chores, you know, um, and whether you think he's shit or not, you can't deny that he's pretty likely to win games because he min maxes, so it's like, it's not really, uh, you know. I could G dodge there and get him to there and block him, or I could GFI here and block him and then just stand him up, or dodge him and do what? Or dodge him out and then stand him up. He could go there and then he's basing people, isn't he? Oh, he's getting punched. Well done. Right. Yeah, he's pretty good at what he's good, yeah. <laughs> Hello, Pedro. Um, yeah, it shows you what it shows you. Yeah, exactly. It's, you know, it, it is what it is, isn't it? You know, at the end of the day. Um, <laughs> wow, classic. Uh... 
<laughs> yeah, he, he's, he's the best at what he does, but what he does isn't very nice. <laughs> So, yeah, you know, at the end of the day, like, because someone was saying about, uh, you know, coach rating and stuff on Fumble, and they said, if uh, Malmere uses halflings for a bit, then people are going to think he's worse than uh, than Smallman. But it, you would have a better chance of beating Malmere than Smallman, wouldn't you? If Smallman's using min-max chops, and Malmere's using halflings, you do literally have a better chance of beating Malmere. <laughs> So like, oh, I was in range, I didn't even realise. I thought about putting him to guard the back and then I thought, nah, I don't need to. Oh, Hello, Fov Gaming. He's going for this, isn't he? He's going for the, uh, for the stopping me scoring on his drive. Well, he's, he's got a decent chance of it. He's got re-rolls and stuff, hasn't he? Yeah, he's probably going to lose the ball here. Oh, at least he burned... At least he burned... Uh... Oh, he made the 5 plus dodge as well. That doesn't do him any favours, does it? Two GFIs and a one dice. Two GFIs and one dice. It's still doable though, isn't it? Three, three, five. It's probably not that unlikely. <laughs> yeah. Standard. Not surprised. Removal as well, no doubt. I'm well, not a removal, but an AV break. Yeah. I mean, it's not. It's not unexpected, is it? Huh. <laughs> he might end up scoring himself here. Alright, what's this? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. There's still a chance here anyway. Alright, how far can he get? One, two, three, four, five, six, so he can reach me. So I've got to go there. Or, no, because he can just punch him. He can dodge around there or block to there. I think if he goes there, that shuts that shit down. That's better, isn't it? I've got to stand him up to get punched. He's going to have to... No, he doesn't have to block him. He can dodge around to base him with tackle. And then he can punch him into tackle. Or punch him first. Nah. I'd, ra I'd really like to get tackle on this. Okay. At least, at least this guy isn't knocked over. Like, if I'd both downed or double skull there, it'd been really bad, wouldn't it? He has got a babe, so probably going to be down then for the next drive because I did that fucking foul. What an idiot! Uh huh. Your one dice blitz, classic.
Uh, Dark Elves. Head the raw. I didn't like that play. He could have just moved him around, couldn't he? He's gone 4, 5, 6. He could have just done that. Okay. I think that was bad play by him. A relevant block first. Yes, please. We'll see, Pedro. We'll see. <laughs> Hopefully, I'll play it all day. God, I can't believe it didn't. I can't believe it didn't fucking pile in. Right, so it's just a three D, and he goes to there. So I go here, so he can't go to there. Yes. And then where does he go to? Here, three plus away. Here, are three plus away. One, two, three, four, five, six. I can't re-roll the hit. Don't have to. Hey, he didn't even fall over. He did a sidestep, but I couldn't. He marked all my tacklers, didn't he? So there wasn't a lot I could do. Glorious! Right, I'll please get my guys back. Both stay out. Fuck off. I think we've both got like 10 or something. I'm, I've got 9. And he's got 7. No, 3, 6, 9. We've both got fucking 9. Got 4 men out. Outbashed. <laughs> Outbashed. Outbashed myself by fucking fouling. I knew they'd both stay out. Fucking standard, isn't it? If I hadn't fouled, though, I'd be a man up. And still. 1 0 up after his drive is pretty good, isn't it? And no wizard. And a sure hands boy. Yeah, I still can. I've still got a dirty player. <laughs> um, oh, you mean that drive, probably, yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Pile on him. I'll just stay where I am. Him, he can block him. Then he can just blitz without assists, which is quite funny. Or he can block him and then he can go one, two, three, four, five. Blitz him. Right. It is important to score touchdowns, yeah. So you know it's still it's still going well, isn't it? But I'd rather I'd also rather be out bashing him with all the kill skills I've got. Fail, oui, oui, oui. That's both apples gone now. 
Oh yeah, to be fair, he has used both of his apples. <laughs> Get off my fucking pitch, prick. <laughs> well, he can't hit me now, can he? The, the fucking diamond uh, dodge guy. His others might be able to. He can base me, but I've got tacklers all around him. The lizards did not get a wizard, no, good day, Nick. They could have done, they got a bribe and a babe instead. Shockingly, they got a bribe. I never like people getting a bribe. Well, I mean, I don't mind it, but... Uh, Blood Bowl 2, <laughs> can't make sense of this. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's weird, isn't it? <sighs> Maybe I should have blitzed him with a claw pom, but then I guess the claw pom already got fouled. But then it's better to be fouled than to be hit with Mighty Blow, isn't it? No. He's going to do both. Maybe he's just in survival mode now. He's going to foul. Oh, I can't believe I've, I've did that foul. Would have had an extra man. An extra dirty player at that as well. To mop up the survivors. I got a bit too. I've got a bit, a bit, a bit cocky because obviously the game was going quite well, and also a bit uh, wanting revenge for him fouling me. <laughs> yeah, well, that's all right. He's fucking slow, this asshole, isn't he? No, he's not. This is this is fucking the fast one. I don't like the thing too much. If he gets a hit, he gets a hit. I don't really fucking care. <laughs> Let's do. You know, we ain't got time to think, have we? Twenty seconds, all for the best. That's the way. That's the way. If you think you should do anything other than take a 30 second turn and hope, sub 30 second turn and hope for the best, you're not playing Blood Bowl properly in my opinion. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Hey. <laughs> Blitzed his, I blitzed his loner just because it was his fouling with the loners, isn't he? <laughs> well, it looked like a bit of a stupid blitz, but that was the reason. <laughs> Thanks, Pedro. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha. 
And he's getting lucky on these fouls, isn't he? Way luckier than I ever fucking did. Just quietly. That was pretty lucky as well, that one, because now I can only 1D him to get him in to do the blitz. I guess I could run him around there. Yeah, alright, that works. Don't really care about the ball, do I? Just uh, hitting and hurting things. They'll always hit you and hurt you, defend and attack. There's only one way to beat them claw upon the fuck out of them. I'm not going to foul here, because I've got the 2D, if I don't foul. If I don't foul pylon, no, fuck, I'm going to pile on. <laughs> Dickhead. <laughs> what kind of asshole wouldn't pile on? Honestly. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> Just don't fucking play blood ball if you're not going to pile on. <laughs> fucking positioning. Who gives a flying fuck? <laughs> Honestly. Don't believe the naysayers that say, <laughs> that say positioning matters. <laughs> it's just about fucking shit up. <gasps> Pile on! Oh yeah! <laughs> oh nice, a, a fucking pal. And another one. Right. Boom. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nah, it doesn't matter. You can hit my ball if you want. Ah, oh, fuck. I knew I should have re-rolled. Oh, he's dead. Fuck, I shouldn't, I should have re-rolled it. I should have re-rolled it, because I've only got three re-rolls. <laughs> he can hit the ball. <laughs> one, two, <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. He can, but I just thought it doesn't matter if he hits the ball. But it doesn't matter if he hits the ball, but it matters if my guy dies. Yes, yeah, four minutes turns are awful, yeah. <laughs> Good strategy and patience rewarded, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Glorious carnage. Thanks, see ya. <laughs> Absolutely all-star to you, yeah, that's the thing. I mean, obviously, it's not one you can reliably pursue until you have claw, pom. But once you have claw, pom, yes, take out the Saurus. Um, yeah, exactly, that's why he was dodging to make it a screen. But then I thought, it doesn't even matter if he hits the ball. Or puts diamond tackle on the ball. And it doesn't. It literally doesn't matter if he bases the ball or knocks the ball over. But, <laughs> it would have mattered that guy dying, so... Hmm. Maybe I should have re-rolled it just for that. He's only armor eight, isn't he? G-Man 1 is the top division, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> But I mean, right, interesting. He could just blitz and get everyone up and protect. I think the point now is protection rather than violence. Four, five, six. Yeah, it's a regular season plus uh, plus playoffs. Yeah. Cette formation permet d'avancer sans trop de risques. Ça va être dur de leur arracher le ballon. Ça ressemble curieusement à un vieux spectacle traditionnel d'Estali. And then hopefully, 
Hopefully he won't kill any of my men. <laughs> I'm in the crew. Well, I'll be making it. I'll be making a YouTube guide if I get my YouTube's back. <laughs> and then, and then you could watch that, and hopefully I'll explain everything fantastically. Um. <laughs> she spat his girl off all fours. <laughs> By the way, fault I don't know if you told me in chat or if you PM me in Discord, but I haven't been bothered to check my Discord. But if you can send me a message on Discord um, of what I've got to do for um, Jim Con, please, fault Force. But yeah, hello. Yeah, actually playing Blood Bowl 2. Outrageous. Outrageous. Thank you very much. Protect the claw bomb <laughs> and the claw bomb men's. And the strength of guarders. <laughs> not so much the shithead rookies. Who <laughs> can blitz him? Oh, he's not even rookies, the dirty player, shit. Super King is still alive, yeah. I'll try to hurt him. <laughs> Collusion. Unfortunately, yeah, I mean, I used my apple, didn't I? If I hadn't used my apple, believe me, I'd be trying to kill the fuck out of his team. But, <laughs> you know, my apple's gone. So, like every, like every chaos coach, I'm a pathetic, blabbering pussy. <laughs> when my own players are getting punched. <laughs> no, but it, the game's over, isn't it? There's no need to risk any of my players. All that can happen for me now is my players die, which is bad, isn't it? So I should try and not let my players die. That's the only objective. I could try and hurt his mole, but that's not benefiting me, is it? Well, the odds SPP. Still. Question is, do I even score? Because he could, um, it's given away three blocks, isn't it? Doesn't have mighty blow. What would I have on the LOS? Rookie. Ball carrier and dirty player. I'm thinking. <laughs> Flat fat TD. He, he can't level up. I could try and score on a warrior, I guess. The warrior, Sexter's Bones, could try and score. I guess that's an option. He could technically pick up and score, though, if I fail. Yeah, but he, he gets to hit me, doesn't he, if I score? Like, this guy is on 45, which is, you know, puts him... He's two touchdowns away. I'm going to try and end up to him. I'll score on a warrior then. <laughs> oh, I guess the block guard can go on the other ice. If I lose a player now, I'll be a bit sad. Already had one player die this game. Yeah, I really. I've do it. Plenty of people do it in the playoffs and that, don't they? In the playoffs, people don't score because there's no point winning. Scoring an extra touchdown. Pretty common, I think, in the playoffs to not score. To save your team. 
You just hit him with a mighty blow. I don't really, really thought about Mads going. Yeah, all three, all three could die. Another eight and twenty-eight. Really, <laughs> that's great. That's a great command. <laughs> Blots. There's the Blitz Pip. 7th and 8th of September. We'll be playing that as well. We'll be playing two games in that. <laughs> probably, uh, probably only two games, sadly. But there you go. Lots of good players and good teams. Oh, glorious. Careful. We could do it after this game then, eh? And then I can put it on the YouTubes when, I, <laughs> when they... If they get back. <laughs> oh. Six ones. Brutal. Dyer, he's got to be Dyer though, hasn't he? Once or twice. And Dyer's got dwarves and Tri's got dwarves, so it's it's a bit harsh for us Dark Elves having to beat them once or twice. Yeah, crazy weather, isn't it? Blizzard then, rain. It's like England in the summer, usually. <laughs> It's a bit rough, isn't it? In the try matchup, we've basically got two bad matchups and a mirror. <laughs> and then it's not like the other matchups are good, is it? Like it's not like <laughs> you just did a one day instead. Not dead yet. Not dead yet. I'm not going to deal with that, Pedro. I'm not a cheater. <laughs> It's not a super great matchup though, is it? It can't buff back. Like at the end of the day, I think whoever's luckiest is gonna win. Oh, hello, Yanni. Whoop, idiot. Yeah, hopefully the YouTube will be back soon. Fingers crossed. GG. <laughs> so what did I kill? Just I didn't think it was a great player that I killed. Just a block. So. <laughs> Glorious! It did take a while. I really was thinking about not scoring just because I thought, what does it matter if I score? You know. Um, well, there you go. Anyway, got more AV breaks with Claw Pom. <laughs> Made more blocks. More injuries. More KOs. Mine, my KOs didn't come back. But I uh, got a bunch of SPPs. And uh, top of the league when, when, when we get the third win on there. <laughs> ah, that's because I didn't quit that. Right, that's it. It's been confirmed. 
I don't think anybody got a level. I don't think anyone's really very close. Um, they're both on 55 now. Yeah, he's the closest one. And then I deliberately didn't score with him. <laughs> uh, so there you go. There's leader one, top of the league. Oh, yeah. Uh, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.